Well, you work for Zenith That's as right. head of innovation? Uh, Zenith in the USA, uh, EVP head of innovation. So what does that mean in terms of, what are you looking <laughs> for, especially a week like this, in terms of you know innovative ideas, what concepts? What does that mean? That's probably the question I get asked the most uh, from members of my family, people that, that know me and people that don't know me. Uh, broadly speaking, it's my job to understand change. Uh, it's my job to understand how technology is making new things possible, what that means for companies, what kind of opportunities that creates, what threats that creates, um, and then to kind of apply those learnings to our clients' business. So it can be in the world of media, it can be in the world of advertising, but hopefully and more often than not, it's actually beyond that. So it's looking at everything from chatbots to voice commerce to artificial intelligence to targeting uh, to new retail practices um, and really kind of ideating around that. Digital transformation. Yes. What does what should companies be thinking about beyond just that term? What what yeah, what yeah. should they really be looking at in terms of the overall experience? Digital transformation for me, and these are very personal definitions. It's about how companies can kind of restructure themselves, how they can create new processes, how they can create new workflows. Um, to one, sort of deal with the threats that that creates, um, but two, more optimistically, look at the opportunities that that means. So why did Hertz not create Zipcar or Uber? Why did Marriott not create Airbnb? Why did a telephone operator not create WeChat? It's trying to get companies to think differently, to be more optimistic, to be more progressive, to take more risk, uh, to sort of embrace creativity, um, and basically kind of recreate what they should be right now in the digital age. Yeah. What's a personal risk or personal pivot you had that you remember yeah. was like sort of you hitting a ref hit refresh button? Yeah, I don't know why I'm such a pain, but I love risk. I love change um, and I like being scared. So I tend to sort of mess up things in my life whenever things get too comfortable. So I've done this a few times, but one of the more dramatic ones, I think, um, I used to work at the Interpublic Group in their innovation lab. Um, and we had an incredible environment uh, with access to incredible technology and uh, routine access to very senior clients. And I just became quite frustrated that we weren't able to follow through with some of the bigger and bolder aims that we had. So the CEO of JetBlue would walk around and we talk to them about reimagining jet travel and they would love the idea of doing stuff like that with us, but we didn't have access to the right staff um, and the right way of thinking to be able to do that. So I got quite frustrated. Um, so I left uh, the advertising business and set up my own consultancy. Um, so I went from quite a nice, comfortable job um, in a nice apartment, uh, staying in the spare floor of my sister's house um, and just sort of starting from afresh. So I started writing at that time and I started kind of proactively going after clients. So it was quite a big risk to take. Uh, it took a while to pull off, but I guess uh, hopefully here and now I can say that it has.